I was making cucumber soup in my kitchen and I was distracted by a flash of blue that streaked by my kitchen window. My son Samuel out in the garden dressed as Cinderella. It was one of the most beautiful sights I've ever seen. Now two years ago that little boy dressed as Cinderella became a little girl. This is my daughter Sadie Rose Fagan and we just recently celebrated her eighth birthday. My husband and I were at dinner with uh, some business colleagues of his and the wife asked, do you have photos of your children? In seconds, I saw that she had found the photo of our little Cinderella. She went, is that your son? Oh no, 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 you must not indulge your child this way. Our son liked to play dress up too. We did not indulge it. Today, our son is totally normal. Is indulgence the same as permission? I like to think that the permission that we gave Sadie in her early childhood allowed her to feel safe so that when she did gain the ability to really articulate how she felt. After years of misery, I had a child who was so excited to be celebrating herself. Just look at the joy on, on her face. It's so pure. There's a statistic that every single parent of a transgender child knows. 40% of transgender people will attempt suicide. A child who is accepted by their family is eight times less likely to attempt suicide. Dig past your fear and find compassion. You are not indulging that child. You are offering them love, and a place in this world.